So you want to be a PJ, but you don't know how to tread. Right? You want to be a combat controller. Either way, you need to know how to tread. So I got some ideas. So treading water isn't just treading water. Treading water is everything that comes with it. It's that confidence. It's what's going on in your head. If you can be confident underwater, and you can be confident on land and if you can be confident in deep water then you can be really confident on land so I'm gonna to talk to you today about treading water yeah I know I'm showing you my room uh, if anybody's wondering I don't like being on the camera I like teaching yes it's a, my nerf gun I got for Christmas but anyway <laughs> Uh, I like teaching, but I don't necessarily like to be the focal point. I think the focal point should be what I'm teaching you. And so, treading water, very, very important task, very, very important period, I think, as a PJ. So, everybody's got a bed, maybe you have something to grab onto, and so you need to, let's see if I can do this, this is, all right, let's see, I have a mirror. I didn't really think this out before I started it. Alright, so the egg beater is circular motion in and out. This is my right leg. Uh, it's it's like a helicopter. You're catching the water and that's that's why it's called the egg beater or a whip kick. What propels, propels you is that downward motion just like a helicopter it's going faster when it's coming that way so do both legs Boom. both of them go in and uh... My, it's a modified egg beater my egg beater has become more modified i've seen some guys that just can go real nice and slow but in the beginning when you learn how to tread it's fast you gotta do it because uh, you're trying to propel, propel yourself, and then as you get better, it's not not so hard, and you can go slower. So you can do that. When you get really good, you can see how bringing your legs out at the same time. It's a little hard when you don't have someone to film for you. Um, but that's treading water. Very important thing to be a PJ. I think probably the most important thing of being a PJ is you should know how to tread. Because if you can be confident, like I said, in deep water, underwater, when people start trying to hurt you or do things, you'll be like, I got this. Nobody's trying to drown me in a pool, and life is good. So uh, good luck in whatever you want to do. If you want to be a PJ, a controller, or a SEAL, or a recon, or uh, just learn to tread water. And... Uh, the most thing I can tell you is the more you practice, the better you'll be. So get out there and practice. Spend more time in the water. Make the water your home. Have a good one.